Hey everybody, Chuck and Stacy here with VO Buzz Weekly, and we are back. Thank you so much to all the new subscribers. Haven't subscribed Thank yet? You. Please do so now. And we are back with part two with Sombra and Symmetra, Carolina Rivasa and Anjali Bamani. Let's, Let's get, get buzzed. buzzed. Turn it up. Get ready. You're tuned in to VO Buzz Weekly. Weekly. And now, prepare to get seriously buzzed with your hosts, Chuck Duran and Stacy J. Aswan. So, are you guys good friends, best friends? You just we hate each, each other. other. <laughs> I don't like her at all. I text Stay her away. more than I text anybody. Really? Yeah. Yeah. And you live Same together? Way. No. no. <laughs> <You don't? laughs> Even when she lived in New York, everyone thought we lived together. I'm like, no, we get on planes you, all the time. Yeah, I swear to God, you guys act like sisters. Like you're just like with each other. From another all the time. mister, maybe. It's yeah. so but cool. Yeah, no. we live really close. We do to each other, um, <laughs> and we try to do yoga and exercise together, or a hike, or uh, let me drive here yeah, together. That's more like she tries to convince me to do something active, and I go along for the comedy factor because I'm really bad at exactly. it. Exactly. Really good. <laughs> because she likes to pull the comedy out. Mm -hmm. I've seen her do right. some bad the booty stuff. Falls. So obviously this is a very roller coaster kind of career. Um, how do you guys keep the balance, stay in the gratitude of it when it's doing that? Oof, that is such a good question because sometimes you don't. You know, I think for me sometimes just allowing myself to have a moment rather than beating myself up for what, what's wrong with me, why am I not grateful in this moment, just being like, yeah. okay, this, this is just what's happening at this moment, I'm just feeling this right now, I'm allowed to feel it, but move past it. Mm -hmm. Let it, like, you don't have to beat yourself up for it, but move past it. But um, perspective is really everything. And not in a sense of like, comparing oneself to, to people who are in abject poverty or, or, or starving, because there's always going to be that in the world and that's always going to be terrible. But even just the perspective of where you are today versus where you were a day ago, a right. week ago, right. a year ago. Um, some of the struggles that both of us have been through were, were painful enough that to be able to get past those and use those experiences both for our acting, but also for compassion for other people. Mm -hmm. That right there, like, that gives you a, a reason to be grateful you even went through the crappy yeah. stuff. Yeah, yeah. Crappy's fine. The crappy yeah. stuff. That's fine. Yeah. yeah, I mean, <sighs> Wow. Last year was really hard for me. But I found her. Yeah. And, and she dragged me through the tough stuff to pull me out. And that's why I'm really thankful. Um, I think we were both dealing with different kinds of loss. And so sometimes you just find somebody that's going to help you through it. Um, but before meeting Anj, I think I also have always known that I need to have really important people in my life that I can count on. Yeah. And I have a group of girls in New York. Mm -hmm. They're all Hispanic actresses. And we meet up once a week to have coffee and commiserate and, and help each other out. And, and if I have a VO audition that I think they're good for, I'm gonna recommend them. And you know, uh, and if one didn't book that pilot she wanted, you know, we'll go out and drink together. But I think that you have to find your people that are gonna lift you up because, mm -hmm. God, it's such a hard career and you just need to constantly be reminding yourself that you are enough and that you're bringing so much to the table. And so it is about about just highlighting the good and yes, some things suck and so you just need to sit in them and, and know that tomorrow, whatever, it's a new day. Yeah. But I think, I think uh, bringing humanity to it and connecting with, with real life humans and putting your phone down and leaving mm. the Facebook yeah. away and mm. that's not proper grammar, putting it all away we know and to remember that saying. we need yeah. to do yeah. this, you know, yes. and yeah. not be jealous yes. because someone booked that and it's just like, let's, let's just be human and, and remember yeah. that we're all, yeah. Yeah. We're all in the thick of it, you know? Mm -hmm. Well, you definitely brought a little Ooh, tear out to my yeah. eye right Sorry. there. Uh, I was just uh, thinking about... We went Barbara Walters, people! Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, yes! <laughs> But what is this? But Oprah, she's so right. Oprah Winfrey? There's, there's, it's Oprah and Barbara. No, my but it's, gosh, no, thank you so much for opening up and sharing and with you us. Are so, and you are so measured by the company that you keep, yeah. right? And, and also, you know, um, I say this a lot, the, the dearest people in my life, obviously Carolina included, accept me exactly as I am, but won't settle for me being anything less than I can be. Mm -hmm. And there are those days when you have a really hard time keeping... Uh, you know, hitting that bar or keeping yourself high. And that's when you have people around you who will hold the space saying, I know, 
I know this thing for you is going to happen, or I know this is going to pass. Yeah. yeah. What you're going through. So I'm gonna I'm gonna be here and bear witness to what you're going through. Yeah. But at the same time, yeah. I'm gonna hold the space because I know something grand is coming. Yeah. Whatever whatever that might be. And and having those special people yeah, it's in like your you, life. You hold hope for them while they can't. Right. You know? And, yeah. then, and give them the freedom yes, to yes. say, I can't see it right now. Right. That's right. totally right. fine. Not like right. fuck up, little camper. Yeah. Yeah. It's no, it's useful. really beautiful when you have people because we both have that. We're that for each other. When you can give yourself permission and give each other permission to just be who you are mm -hmm. with no conditions and no yeah. fear of rejection, yeah. rejection or judgment. Yeah. It's Especially special. when I do like really bad comedy and she still laughs at it. <laughs> and she still laughs at it. That's she because me the, like, you're probably funny. Or she just gives that. me the, the, the non look where she just kind of. Just a non look where I'm like, There's, I did good. I made you laugh on the inside. Like the Indian chipmunk. Well, you know, an Indian chipmunk is a very funny thing. <laughs> oh my god, that's yeah, hysterical. That's okay. yeah. It should be a cartoon, man. That character has <laughs> to come alive at some Alvin, point. Alvin, Alvin, Simon, a little, and Theodore. Oh. He's a little yeah. chipmunk that lives in a yeah. banyan tree. Yeah. I love it. Does. In my brain. Listen, we are all about <laughs> inclusion and diversity. The culture's going that way. Thank goodness. So. Yeah. You why not? What? Why not? Maybe chipmunks. that's yeah. maybe chipmunks, that's your chipmunks are people too. Then yeah. maybe that's your show to pitch. Absolutely. That's your next um, we were talking about conventions uh, a little bit ago, and can you guys give us like maybe personally some highlights for you uh, of these cons? Like, what do you love about them? I mean, you wouldn't go to them if you didn't like going. So, right. what do you like oh, about them? These the people, just the people, the community. They are so artistic and giving and generous and creative and effusive and, and uniquely themselves. Like it's a, it's a place where people feel, hopefully actually feel as free as they seem as to, to feel, yeah. to be able to celebrate their enthusiasm for pretty much anything. Mm -hmm. Because the only difference between, the only difference between being a geek or a nerd or being not is that you are super enthusiastic and knowledgeable about something that might not be mainstream. Right. That's right. literally the only difference. Yeah. So it's like, okay, well, it's football or gaming, or it's this or that, and and here the the playing field is leveled because everyone gets to celebrate who they are, and they're just so giving. They're so yeah. kind. Yeah. Yeah, I think it's just been really special to meet uh, the Overwatch community that loves the game and and to hear how it's affected them positively. I, I didn't play video games as a kid, so I just thought they were, you know, pure entertainment. But I feel like Overwatch has transcended that, and it's just gone so much deeper into people's lives. Yeah. And you see full, like, families that play yeah. together, mm -hmm. or, or people that met on the game, and then they got married. Um, mm -hmm. We hear all these wow. crazy stories. Yeah. And and the game, they, the game has been a positive thing in a lot of people's lives. And so when I hear those stories, I'm just... I move to tears a lot of the yeah. times, because yeah. I can't yeah. believe it, you know? Yeah. Yeah. And getting to partake in that joy and... and you know, it's a really special thing. So I think most of it is is meeting them is just wonderful. I mean, of yeah. course, we meet awesome voice actors. Yes. You know, we have a lot of right. fun. But right. I think that the interaction is is really really fun. Yeah, yeah. yeah. it's yeah. funny because most of the voice actors that we talk to and we ask that question to, like mm -hmm. almost every single person says the same thing. It's yeah. they go they the people. Mm -hmm. You know, they they get to yeah. meet that are just like they touch they they touch their hearts. You know, yeah. 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 Right. yeah. So cool. Yeah. Well, the art form, you know, there's different forms of art, but it's universal. It, it transcends language. Mm -hmm. It trans transcends everything. So it's very special to know that this is part of your legacy. How, how special is that? Which it's, is, yeah, it's, right? it's, I don't understand. To say humbling sounds, uh, la, la, but it's so humbling to yeah. think that anything that, that we could do could be a, even a tiny little part of having that kind mm -hmm. of effect yeah. on, on yeah. someone's life. Yeah. Um, that's... Well, it's well deserved, and you two really carry that mantle with dignity and class. Totally, and I feel. Good yeah, yeah. I so feel eloquent. that you yeah, guys. No, no one's ever told me I had dignity in class before. Listen, maybe not so much class, but so a lot class. of dignity. And what no. size is your foot? Because I might need those boots. Uh, like, those boots five and a half, and you can't switch. have them. <laughs> five you and can't half? have oh them. I am a five and a half. They're glued oh, to my legs. Oh, she's tearing them up. It's a I know. Come on, we'll trade. Oh my God. Okay. Five and a half. This dignity. is exciting. Talk now, and we're going to switch shoes at the end of this. This is too. exciting. Maybe, you two Maybe totally I should good. leave. I rarely and need a five and a half. We should do a show about shoes. Show. I want to have a camera for the shoes because my shoes get a lot of um, a lot of uh, play. I mean, people ask about the shoe. You should get sponsored by a shoe company. Right? Yeah, yeah. Hello. Ooh, All right. Shoe dazzle me. This, this is maybe kind of a weird question. 
but I'm gonna Stacey, ask you. Stacy, that was ask really it. weird. I love weird questions. <laughs> Thank you for accepting me. Um, <laughs> but I, and I don't mean this from a place of ego, but like, what what qualities do you really love about yourselves? And you could answer it for yourself, and then I would be curious what you love about each other. Like, oh my god, that's so much easier. I was just like, can right. I just talk about her? Because that's so but much no, easier. I think it's really important to be able to say, I love about me that I'm loyal, that I am, you know, focused. That I, you know, I think that it's. So I'm just curious from your perspective, what is it that you really go? You know what? I'm, I'm, I'm happy with myself in those ways. Um. Well. I like silence. It. No, 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 <laughs> no. I, I, I is that a weird? I mean, is that a weird? Because no, I don't mean it from a place no, of ego. It's no. really it's it's, it's important. An intriguing I think question. Yeah. Yeah. needs to know that about themselves. Um, well, I. It's funny because people ask that about Sombra, and there are two things that I always say that I like about her, and I think I find them in myself. Um, I like finding comedy in a lot of situations, mm -hmm. and that keeps um, that keeps me lighthearted. Um, it keeps my family like when we have a really good time because. I mean, it, even when I'm dealing with heartbreak or like loss or whatever, I will find a joke to make, yes. and it it might be self-deprecating, but it is a, it's it's survival mode, whatever. But yeah. you know, it, it is a way to to keep afloat, and I I kind of dig that that I can keep stuff light, you know. Beautiful. Um, and I think that I've always had a sense of confidence. Uh, you know, some people when when they audition and don't book the role, everything crumbles and and they start questioning, you know, a lot of things. And I think that luckily. Um, even when I haven't gotten the, my dream role, I know that I still have something very important to show the world. Mm -hmm. um, whatever it is, whatever it is that I'm, you know, it's not that I'm the best or the prettiest or the tallest or the whateverest. It's just that it's something different and unique and, and we all have that place in the world. And, and I just have a very clear sense of that, you know? Yeah. And so um, I think knowing that, I, I haven't found myself. I'm still searching for myself, of course. Yes. But I'm okay with that person that I am now and, and presenting it. It's beautiful. The world, you know? I love that. I love that too. Beautiful. And that makes sense about all the things that I love about you when you say that. Oh, yeah. You guys are too good. Um, <laughs> I, I, you know, I used to think that this was a, a, not a good thing, but I love that I. I'm kind of a mama wolf, like I kind of, in fact, I played a mama wolf, so it makes sense that I would be a, a mama, but I, 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 I'm very protective and caretakery, caretakery, is that a technique? Caretakery, it is. we just made it That's up. It's a legit make up word, you guys. Time. Make yeah. them up. Um, but that I, that I care so much about, about other people that I, you know, I, my, my, <laughs> my better half always says, you are the girl who runs into the accident. Yes. And and I and I do and I've never really thought of it that way, and um, you know I might not necessarily always be great at defending myself because I know how much I can take, but yeah. God help you if you come anywhere near my friends, mm -hmm. and I, I it it I used to think or other people would say oh that's not good you're a people pleaser or whatever and I'm like no I just I like defending the underdog yeah and then frankly I just like making sure that my people are taken care of mm -hmm. whoever those people happen to be. Um, and and I like that I learned somewhere along the way, I learned that nothing good ever comes from me trying to be cool. So <laughs> I'm so I'm so much happier like making stupid faces and like looking at people yes. with one like one lazy eye. Like I've always I've always preferred that lane. And um, tell them to look into your good eye. Yeah, look into my, look at my good eye. Oh, look at my. <laughs> oh, I wish you had told me that before. Can Ooh. we get a different frame now we'll on the get camera? My good eyes. <laughs> You're so bad. Yeah, I, I am, but it's, it's, it's how I make people love. I'm yes. like, this is very serious business. This is very, yeah. very you serious. Your Stop quirks. it. Yeah, yes. but so rather than trying to be the cool one or the sexy one, I was like, I got no chance in hell of that. So let but me just enjoy. Are. But yes. but this is also where um, um, whatever adversity might go on in my own head rather than using it as a reason to you know crawl in a hole and die it's a reason to like well let me hone some other talents let me be this smart kid or yeah. the this or the that yeah. Yeah. and um and I, I I actually do like that about myself because um, it keeps me entertained, even if it doesn't do that for me. <laughs> She's laughing all the time by herself. <laughs> I like singing songs yeah. to myself. Hey, it's you know what? If you're not your own best there. friend and your own best, <laughs> best wingman, well, totally. what's you the know, point, Who right? else do you spend 24 hours a day exactly. with for the rest of your entire life? Exactly. You better enjoy your own company. And Absolutely. I did it for a long time when yeah. I was younger. Um, I, I, I spent a lot of years 
not liking myself. You're so that's why it took me a minute. You're good people. Yeah. <laughs> You're a good person. You're a good person. All the ones that are in there. Um, all of the Anjali's in there. Uh, well, <laughs> gals, we have a um, mystery question. Ooh. Fun. Ooh. It's the cube. Is this the board? They're so in tuned that they could pick a card for each so other. So you can each pick your own card. And Chuck always... Always likes read it in your favorite um, character. In your favorite character, oh my God. you want you don't, and you can answer it as you know for yourself or you, know, but you can pick a card. Pick a mm -hmm. card. Any oh, card. I don't trust myself at all. I hate you. This is my favorite, favorite character. Good. I got a lot it's of personalities like, inside of me. Do each you. line I'm in fear one. Of getting in trouble each in word in its own okay. character. Okay, I got one. This isn't a test I can fail, no. is it? I'm a good And if student. you completely loathe the question, guess what? Oh, this we is know hysterical. the producers, we can find okay. it. Alright, all right. Carolina, all right. go all first. Right. What three adjectives would your family use to describe you? Oh. Ooh. Ooh. So is Anja responding this or am I? No, you are. No, you are. Oh my god. And don't lie. <laughs> no. We have can't. them on the line. They're gonna co know. corroborate um, your story. Amanda? Is she here? Yeah. <laughs> um, uh, loud. Loud? For sure. Number one. They're always telling me to turn the volume down. Turn the volume oh, down. Oh my god. <laughs> Baje el volumen all the Baje time. Baje volumen, so see. Um, not in my house. You're not allowed. Uh, a fighter of sorts, like, mm -hmm. you know? Mm. Yeah. Tenacious. Yes. Mm -hmm. Gracias. Tenacious. Tenacious. Mm -hmm. Very tenacious and um, uh, <laughs> trying to think about the next one. Some, something like, uh, you know, uh, Com comedic, yeah, because I'm I'm or clown-ish. Clown. Yeah. My dad would say moscorrofio. That just means Corrofio? I'm a moscorrofio. Yeah. I'm just a yeah. mess of a human being, but in a good way. Ah, right. Ah, so ah, right. Ah, yeah. From every story that you have told me about your family talking <laughs> about you, I would add. I bet they would say you were brave. Oh. Mm. They would. They absolutely would. So baby, you're so baby, brave, baby. you gave um, four adjectives. I'm you her that, sister right? from another mister, she so is, I could be her is. family and say yeah. that. I'm not going to answer this. This is not my you, favorite you voice, but to, I just keep oh. doing this Kardashian voice. Yes, so do it. We love the about. Kardashian voice. Oh, oh, God. Um, oh, who? I don't even know how to answer this question. Well, first read it and then answer it. I'm going to have to say it like this because I don't know why that voice is coming out. If you could be any athlete for a single game, who would you choose? Ah! I don't do sports only. I don't know. Um, <laughs> no, that, I don't know that I would be what the about Williams twins. Gymnastics well, or... I, yeah, there's so many. Like, Swimming. Are you a swimmer? I was, but then I have double jointed shoulders, and then one shoulder popped out, and I was oh. swimming in circles, and it was all. <laughs> I swam butterflies. I and swam it, in circles. No, you literally put your just boxes open. I told you, you have got to be careful. Honestly, um, my darling, would you like? Can I pick another question? question? Oh my God, yes. yes. No, pick another question. <laughs> she wants another question. Is that okay? Then you have to read it in a new character. Because there are so many amazing That's athletes it. in the world, and I just want to be all of them. I want to be Lynn Hill, the Okay, here we go. Ah. More what better? is the most fun party you ever attended? <gasps> I love her. <laughs> um, I can't say what the specific celebration was for. Right. But we had an event at my parents' house last year where we invited just like the A team of our lives and um and it was the most unique and extraordinary group of people from from all over our our life, I've never I've never had a celebration of life like that before. And my my father, before he passed away, had always wanted us to to have that party um, in the house. And he passed away last January, mm. and so we did it. Uh, wow. We did that party in September, and this one surprised me. It showed up. She ah. told me she couldn't come, and she showed oh. up. Oh, I guess we just but they had so they it was had a we written oh. out cards for every guest. Mm. Saying Same. why they are here, like wow. specifically why you are an important part of yeah. our That's lives. That's outrageous. Well, I mean, you guys, I'm. Uh, it's clear you're very close to your families. I'm very close with my families, as is Chuck. But what I think is beautiful is when you go out into the world and you find your chosen, what I call our chosen family. Mm -hmm. Amen. And you have clearly done that, and we celebrate that. We feel like we've made friends for life. Um, in you too, and congratulations on all of your abundance, Absolutely. and may it continue. You. You're always welcome thank here, you. and thank you for thank all you're you. putting out in the world. It's really, yeah. it's really a pleasure to watch your bloom. 
Absolutely. Oh Thanks thank for you. Yeah. And thank you for this. Thank what, a, yeah. what a fantastic Thank you for pouring time. out your hearts. I, my yeah. eyes have been like teary eyed for the past half hour because you guys are I just I cut like an onion. It's sitting over there. Heart, mm -hmm. heart, heart, heart. I believe, I believe that the two of you haven't even begun to scratch the surface yeah. of your success. It's exciting. And we, we are so grateful for the you to be here with it. us. Thank the you. Thank you. It. Follow these guys. They're on Twitter, Instagram, Absolutely. Sweet Ange, Ravasa, Carolina Ravasa, Villobos Weekly, la, 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 la. Find it. Do it. them. Yeah. Yeah, love you guys. Interviewers Thank you. ever. Yeah, Thank this you. was amazing. Thank you. Thank so you. thorough and creative <laughs> and deep. Oh my gosh, really. Yeah! Thank you. We'll Girl see you guys team. next time, ladies and gentlemen. Say bye bye. <laughs> bye. 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 I'm Anjali Bamani. And I'm Carolina Ravasa. And, and we, we just, just got buzzed, buzzed with Chuck, Chuck and Stacey. Woo! Um, that was so weird what I just did there. Um, speaking of weird, Stay weird. Be the you that is you. All of the things that make you unique, live those, love those. Be the person that is uniquely you because there is only one you in all of creation. And without that you, the world will never have the experience of that creation. Exactly. Embrace your weirdness and follow your dreams. Well, that concludes our two-part episode with Carolina and Anjali. We're going to be back next week with a whole new VLBuzz Weekly for you. Yes, they are so amazing, aren't awesome. they? They are. Hey, don't forget to leave your comments and questions below. And follow us all on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. We love you guys. Thanks for watching. And just remember, you, you always, always have, have time for a little buzz. buzz. Buzz Weekly is sponsored by Chuck Duran's Demo That Rock. Rock. The voice of a demo producer to the stars is now available to you. Visit DemosThatRock.com and take your voiceover career to the next level. See you next time. And remember, you always have time for a little buzz.